Well, school may be out, but districts are already looking ahead to next year and how to handle masks. Officials in Orange County started discussing their plans today. New 6's Lauren Cervantes breaks down today's debate. It's a big discussion that school boards are tasked with ahead of the next school year. Should masks be optional? Well, today, Orange County Public Schools held a work session to discuss just that. In our revision, face coverings will be permitted at the discretion of each student, employee, visitor, or vendor, but it will not be required. Orange County Public Schools laying out proposed revisions to the current mask policy, which would make masks optional for the upcoming school year. The whole purpose for revising the rule covering policy to make the wearing of uh, face coverings voluntary is based upon guidance from the state. The meeting, which OCPS says will not include a vote today, had doctors weighing in on the subject, some expressing concerns over making masks optional. I do agree that uh, mask use will be helpful especially in that population of children that haven't had the opportunity to be vaccinated. But other medical experts calling for the option to wear them. I would conclude for you at this point in time that we can permit masks to still be used with guidance to parents, staff, visitors and vendors who are unvaccinated to have them strongly consider wearing a mask to protect themselves. Dr. Annette Nielsen, a pediatrician with Treehouse Pediatrics, saying that age should also be a factor when it comes to wearing masks, saying kids under 12 don't have the opportunity to protect themselves by getting the vaccine. Three year olds to your 11 and you know, nearly 12 year olds, they don't have an option. They don't have an option to be protected from a vaccine. We, however, have an option and I believe a duty to keep that subset, that group protected. I feel that that group should wear a mask until we have the ability for that group to actually have a vaccine option. Again, no vote today, but OCPS says the proposed effective date for the revisions would be no later than August 2nd. And Orange County wasn't the only district to meet today. Osceola and Seminole counties both held school board meetings to discuss their mask policies for the upcoming school year. For now in Orange County, I'm Lauren Cervantes, getting results, News 6.